Thanksgiving is just 38 days away, followed immediately by the traditional rush of holiday shopping. But retail experts are saying if you wait till then, it may be too late. They're warning shoppers to start early. Victor Puente explains. Several of the shoppers I spoke to today told me they normally don't begin their Christmas shopping until November. They admitted that global shipping issues have them rethinking that decision. Deborah Fisher told me she normally waits to do her holiday shopping a little closer to Thanksgiving. But this year, she hopes to start before the kids are trick-or-treating. Yeah, we're going to start. Yes, we only have, what, a couple of weeks? Yes, we most definitely. Shoppers who have already started told me they realized if they didn't make some orders before Black Friday, they might not end up under the tree. The ship date on a lot of toys are like November 29, and so it's really, really scary that, th you know, to think that um, people are trying to order online and get their Christmas gifts, and it's going to be like a very late date for them to arrive. The Kentucky Retail Federation says shopping early should be a priority. The supply chain crisis has moved from factories in China to ports in the U.S. New Orleans, Los Angeles, uh, New York, uh, they're backed up where they have a lot of uh, containers that are stacked up in the ports and there's not enough truck drivers. He says they aren't expecting any food shortages, but some items might be harder to come by. Again, you might want to go ahead and plan to go ahead and get those items you need for those special recipes. As for when things might return to normal, we may be ringing in the new year with the crisis ongoing. Transportation Secretary uh, Buttigieg basically said over the weekend that it could take until uh, sometime next year to, to get that sorted out. Everyone beware that item might not be there, so you better start shopping now. Four of the people I talked to today told me they already have all of their holiday shopping finished. And there was one couple who told me they were just going to send cash to all of their grandkids. I guess that never goes out of style. In Frankfort, Victor Puente, Fox 56, 10 o'clock news. McLean says this is a good opportunity to spend more money locally, whether that means from boutique gift shops or gift cards to local restaurants. But he said even some of them have had issues getting their supplies because of that shipping crisis.